While lying in bed at night, I think of Yuzu's words. A power up through sex. Huh? <laughs> That's such an Edoge trope. I just have to have sex, so she says. It's not like what Yuzu said is completely nonsensical. Just by kissing, I was able to amplify the Doryoko of others by an unbelievable degree. Misa-sensei during training camp was incredible, after all. Misa-sensei's lips were so soft. Wait, that's not it. That's not what I meant. Do I dislike doing something like that with Akane or Kamishiro? If someone asked me that, I would say no in a heartbeat. If there is a man who would say no to doing lewd things with such cute girls, I would like to meet that man. But if it's not from a result of love, but instead to become stronger and win the inter-school competition, then I would have a problem with it. Uh, but if I do it, we could win. That idea itself is very tempting. I know how much work Akane has put in for this competition. No, not just Akane. Kamishiro and even myself, not to mention everyone who supported us. Everyone put in so much effort for this one goal. Enough to think we could do anything for achieving that goal. But I don't know. And once again, my thoughts loop back to step one. Sex. That's something important you do with someone you love, right? Could I take away such a precious event from Akane or Kamishiro just so we can win a match? This is completely different from taking a drug or training, you know? But if that's what Akane or Kamishiro wants, what should I do? If either of them said they will do anything it takes to win, what then? Ah, forget it. For a while I roll around in bed, agonize over it, then think some more. Then finally I come to a decision. The day before the final match. We are gathered in Yuzu's re research lab, but in actuality it's just me and Yuzu along with Akane and Kamishiro. Awkward. When I catch a glimpse of Akane and Kamishiro, I can see that dark circles have formed under their eyes. Could they have been agonizing over the same thing as I have been? While I think about that, Kamishiro raises her head and looks over to me. Huh? The moment Kamishiro says that, my heart goes badump. Uh, what is it? I try to suppress my nervous voice as best as I can. この間、ソメアが言ってたこと。私なりに考えた。確かに合理的。ほぼ確実に長時間のパワーアップが見込めるのなら。Akane screams while blushing with a bright red color. Akane is in an uproar. When Yuzu asks timidly, Kamishiro looks back at Yuzu with a piercing look. Akane
もちろん理解しているでもそうする以外に勝つ道がないならやる靖国は勝ちたいんでしょアカナ hesitates while Kamishiro fixes her gaze onto her だからといってそんな靖国は勝ちたいんじゃなかったの Hey, wait just a moment, Kamishiro. I couldn't let this go by, so I enter into the fray. Are you okay with that, Kamishiro? Rather, why are you willing to go that far? So, so da! Toko was I should tatakai ta kun hai te hit te ta janai ka! Demo, Kashiku eko wa honki o dashte kure te runo ga wa karu! So no e, so na koto ma de te kure runo do to. Nani ka hata no ka? Toko looks down on the ground and mutters. Huh? With us just staring without know what she meant, Kamihiro replies quietly. でも、二人は違った。だから、私も二人を対等の仲間だと認めた。だから、大場と靖国の望むことに全力で協力すると決めた。オースティンに言われて、考えて、本気で戦うべきだと思った。カミシロ。Kamishiro has recognized us as her comrades. This makes me extremely happy. Nakamadakara. Akana gets emotional as she looks at Kamishiro with teary eyes. While thinking that Akana is surprisingly easily moved to tears, I also start to shed a tear. From Kamishiro's words, Akana raises a hiccup like sound. Akana bites on her lips hard. Akana's lips tremble. With high tension, Yuzu hurriedly comes into the conversation. With Yuzu's cry, the three of them look at me with a piercing gaze. The three of them look at me with an indescribable look. Cold sweat starts to come out of my back and my heart starts to beat loudly. If I don't say okay, is it rude to the both of them? I try to shake off such thoughts from my head. I already came up with an answer last night. I take a deep breath and answer with confidence. I won't do such thing. Yuzu looks at me with a relieved look. Akana also lets out a plainly noticeable, relieved expression. I can't read Kamishiro's face. Even though she said all those things, I wonder if I made her mad. But I slowly shake my head. No, that's not it. I want to win, but to do it by sleeping with the two of you is wrong, I think. Yeah, how to say this? Well, isn't such a thing important? Kamishiro nods at my words. I am relieved to know that she knows that it's an important thing. 
Akane and you are important to me. An important comrade. That's why doing it for the inter-school match is... Uh, something that I don't want to do. So. I'm sorry, even though you said all those things. When I lower my head, Kamishiro shakes her head. Even if it's by a little, the tension that was in the air definitely feels like it's disappearing. Towards Akane, who is yelling red faced, Kamishiro looks puzzled. Akane, who is screaming, and Kamishiro, who has returned back to her normal self, is receiving the brunt of it. I am relieved to see this. Yep, it's okay. Just as it's always been. We just put everything on the line without killing ourselves. When I say that, Yuzu slips out a chuckle as if she finds it funny. Well, I think I did something regrettable as a man. Yuzu walks into the back of the room while humming. Seichi! Oba. <laughs> what is it? I turn towards them as they call me out and I see the two of them looking frighten frighteningly serious. Hey, hey, what's going on? Ah, well, you just wanted us to win, right? The two of them bow their heads. It's embarrassing being told that directly. Didn't you just say something similar to? Even if it was just a little, it looked like Kamishiro smiled. Then, at the same time, Kamishiro comes close to me and tiptoes. Something soft touches my lips. As soon as I realized that it was Kamishiro's lips, she was no longer next to me. I can't think straight. Uh, um, thanks, yeah. Kamishiro did it in such a nonchalant way that I hesitate whether I should be flustered. But before that, Kamishiro gave me a kiss? It's like I'm dreaming. Just when I thought Akane got close to me, she presses against my lips. It felt as though it was suffocatingly long, but it also felt like it happened in an instant. Akane's lips part. My face feels hot. Wait, just what kind of expression should I put on for the two of them? Akane looks at me with upturned eyes while her cheeks blush. Just as always, Kamishiro never breaks her cool gaze. Ah, uh, yeah. I could only nod in response. By the time Yuzu came back, my flushed face has calmed down. Ah, 
ジンさん千春さんとも協力して頑張ります Thank you, Yuzu. Yuzu is a reassuring friend. あとちょっと調べたいことがあるので少しだけ血液サンプルを取らせてもらっていいですか Again? 前のは成分分析に回しちゃったのでもう手元にないんですよ I see. Not that I was going to refuse. セイチはレバーとかほうれん草をたくさん食べて血を増やした方がいいな。Both Akane and Kamishiro seem to have forgotten what happened earlier as they act as if it was business as usual. Such a mood is reassuring to me. One day until the last match. I don't know what will happen, but we have to do whatever we can. I renew my resolve and clench my fist. Because the injuries I received from the previous battle were. Egregious, it took a lot of effort to get my body back into shape within a, a week. On top of that, our next opponent was Eve's team. It was a close battle, even with、uh, Shijo's team, but we still somehow won. I can't imagine we would be able to come out unscathed taking on Eve's team. But we are eager to fight. A match against Eve, the very thing that Akane wanted. That eventually turned into my and Kamishiro's wish too. If I can't move, I at least want to be at the top of my physical condition. With such enthusiasm, the days pass in the blink of an eye. And so, finally, the day of the final battle is here. Whether we cry or laugh, this will be the last. With this match, the competition will be over. Akane murmurs with a nervous look while Kamishiro agrees quietly. Somehow, even Kamishiro looks nervous and it shows on her face. Don't be too nervous, you two. We're going to lose a match that we could have won if you're like that. Kamishiro points her finger at Akane's hand. I can clearly see Akane's tight fist slightly shaking. Well, whether we cry or laugh, this is the end, so let's relax. Akane's face turns even more pale and she grips her fist even more. Uh oh, this might have had the opposite effect. While I worry, a shadow creeps up behind Akane and without warning rushes towards her. <laughs> Taking advantage of her confusion, Chiharu gropes Akane's risky part. <laughs> Kaoru covers his eyes with both of his hands while Jin jets out blood from his nose. Not to mention Chiharu, even I have to look away from what's happening. After finally warding away Chiharu, Akane lets out a large sigh. <laughs> Chiharu laughs while lively moving both her hands. She has been healing Akane during the confusion. Akane blinks in amazement as she opens and closes her hands, swings her arms repeatedly. Then she looks in Chiharu's direction and smiles. そうか。治療だったのだな。ついでに緊張もほぐすとはさすがだな。礼を言って。治療とスキンシップ。それに緊張もほぐせて一石三鳥だね。トウコさんもまだ全開ではないので、動力の上限が落ちてるはずです。あ
Yuzu lets out a troubled smile, but quickly changes to a serious look. Yuzu turns around smiling at Kamishiro and comes towards my direction. Sure. Yuzu takes the old bandages off and tears off the dressing. I did take it directly after all. It gives me the shivers just looking at my scarlet soaked stomach. I was assured that if I were to be lucky enough to fully recover, there wouldn't be any scars. But my pain is gone for the most part. It must be because you and the others worked so hard to treat me. Thank you, Yuzu. I say that with a regrettable feeling while Yuzu is putting on the dressing. While I can express this well, the only people that can compete in the first year's competition are the first years. Of course, there will be another competition next year, but it feels like that will be different from now. And plus, I want to test how far I can go. I can finally do something with Doryoka after all. As Yuzu finishes with wrapping the dressing, she gently puts her hand on my stomach and mutters the following. The warmth that is gradually transmitted to me via her palm. It feels as though that warmth has become an energy that is permeating throughout my body. I thought to myself that Yuzu's touch has more effect than any healing Doryoku. Yeah, of course. As I answer with a smile, Yuzu also breaks a smile. I don't think the opponent will be someone I can trample over, but I will be careful as to not get injured as much as possible. I nod at Yuzu's words and look at Akane and Toko. Yeah, I'm in perfect condition since Yuzu put the bandages on me. We all nod in agreement and head over to the stadium. Yeah, you're right. Kamishiro glances at me with a fleeting glimpse. I will try my best to dodge. I reply as I grip the handle of the nameless sword. Honestly, I don't have much confidence in how much I will be able to evade. But if that's the only thing I can do, then there is no choice but to do so. Mm, what is it? Akane and Kamishiro fix their gaze on me while lining up shoulder to shoulder. For some reason, Akane says that while blushing. What? Huh, but but Yeah, certainly we did, but, but that was just as out of politeness and no, uh thanks to their outrageous suggestion, my head is spinning. The sight of two vibrant pink colored lips will not get out of my vision.
試合に勝つ気合を入れるためなのだ握手と同じだそ,そう思えばおかしなことではないだろう実際に効果もある Well, that may be true, but you just put this out of nowhere. Sage は Sage はやはり私たちとキスをするのは嫌か恋人でもないのにこんなことはできないか大場がどうしても嫌だというのなら無理強いはできない No, that's not what I meant. I say with a small voice to the two of them while my eyes move around aimlessly. If we Kissed in a place like this, everyone would see it. Well, if you say it's like shaking hands, to win I can do that much. As I say that, Kamishiro nods, then grabs mine and Akana's wrist. Where are you taking us, Kamishiro? She stops at the edge of the arena and then turns to face us. Okay, okay, I get it. I am a man. I will keep my word. So. Kamishiro nods slightly, then takes my hand. I feel as though I hear the whisper from the surprised Akane. And there it was. Kamishiro's face right in front of me. As our lips meet, I feel the plumpness and softness of her lips. From the center, something slippery price opens my lips and slips into my mouth. As I space out in amazement, I realize that it's a tongue, Kamishiro's tongue. As Kamishiro's tongue moves boldly in my mouth, though somewhat clumsy, she moves to entwine it with mine. Along with the pleasant feeling I feel, my knees waver and my back relaxes. <laughs> Due to Akane's urging, Kamishiro separates her lips with a reluctant look. The saliva stretches between our lips and then breaks. D do you have to do that much for a k kiss uh, with tongue? Tongue too? When I say that with such stuttering, Kamishiro nods without any discomposure. Then she lightly raises my right hand and tightly grips it. Akane says it in an almost incomprehensible way while blushing. It's mysterious that despite her being that nervous, I can calm down conversely. Akane, ready? What is that? I never heard of anyone being hurt physically with a kiss. Akane pouts as I say that with a slightly laugh. Let's win, Akane. I put my hand on Akane's head and gently pull her towards me. As if to pluck the hole she tries to reply from, I put my lips on Akane's. Just like how Kamishiro did to me, this time I extend my tongue through Akane's lips. Akane stiffens her body in my arms. As we slowly part our lips, only Akane's intoxicated eyes fill my vision. Uh, I can't really help it. For me, all I did was to simply put in as much effort as possible in order to amplify Akane's Doryoke. Akane puts her hand on her chest and whispers it. How about your Doryoke? Does it feel like it got amplified? 
If that wasn't the case, then it would end up meaning that just kissing wouldn't do the trick. Uh, yeah, I prepare myself. It's embarrassing to kiss in front of everyone out to support us, but it has to be done. Anyways, it's finally time for the match against Eve. Let's give everything we have. And then we go up to the arena.